Good evening. Uh, I just want to tell each and every one of my viewers that I appreciate them. And also, I appreciate the other YouTubers that I listen to. And as you may know, I like to look at the future. And I like to look at predictive analysis with statistics, math, science, things like that. And an astrologer, I listen to a few of them I do. And one of them put this link to the clock. They said to look at the clock and um, that astrology is not that hard to learn. And I'm like, oh yeah, maybe for you, but not for me. But so I'm looking around this website that they took me to and it has like a clock on it for the astrology, but I don't know how to honestly... It's like Greek to me. Maybe they find it easy, but I don't find it that easy. And there's this web page. I got the link below for you. But basically, it has astrology and a timeline. And it has this uh, beautiful graphics. It's really well done. And it says here, millionaires don't use astrology. Billionaires do. J.P. Morgan. I don't know if he really said that. I'd have to fact check. But anyway, basically what they do is they say, look at the clock, and they talk about the different periods of time and astrology. And honestly, uh, while they're writing this, they're, whoever's writing this, I don't know who the author is of this, but it's a, um, it's called planetwatcher.com, and it talks about the coronation and the different planets and how they're shaped in the sky. And honestly, I don't understand. He did, he did this video today saying that it was easy to learn astrology, but really it's like a whole nother language. So this is the timeline that um, I'm looking at here. And this symbol here, some people call the symbol Merkaba. And the Merkaba also is seen in the Bible as a parallel of the, in Revelations, the different circles. But it's actually supposed to be like an ascension energy field that's invisible you can't see it but it's an electromagnetic field that comes off of a person and it actually winds up if you look at um kabbalah the shape uh there's like circles here circles here circles here so like it's you know but whoever did this did a really good job on the graphics and um I really enjoyed this, so I thought you might too. It says, this year, please refer to New Year's Eve as 2020, 24 hours to go. And so they have different um, interesting stuff in here. But honestly, I got homework to do, and I got to turn it in. But I thought maybe you would enjoy this little break from the news. You know, uh, Biden was sworn into office, and actually, let's go see the home page. It says, transhumanism is the intentional suppression of our emerging Christ spirit. Interesting. So, I'm not really sure if transhumanism is a mix between a human and a robot, but I'll, I'll have to research this a little bit more. I really honestly don't know about these things this person's been writing about. But they t they're talking about nanotechnology and AI hive mind. That could be kind of like the collective consciousness. But I thought this was kind of fun. Or maybe not. <laughs> it's interesting. So they had this clock here. Here's the clock. And basically today's January 20th, 2021. And they're like, oh, astrology is easy to learn. Do you know what these things mean here? I 
I think this might be Sagittarius. I can't even, like, I think this might be Libra. Um, Cancer, Gemini, Taurus, Aries, Pisces. I, I'm not, I'm not sure. So anyway, I don't know all these symbols, what they mean. I know these are moons. I think Chiron has like a K, like a key. And this is like a north node, south node. Like, I, I, I mean, I, who has time? And this is a lot of work. But anybody that's interested in this, it basically has these, basically this page is dedicated to the clock. And this astrologer's like, pay attention to the clock. And, um, you know, it was last updated on January 7th, I guess. So, it's very interesting. And, let's see, dark mode. Whoa. Okay. I like, if you're sleeping or something, or getting ready to go to bed, it's nicer to look at dark mode. So the dark kind of lets these colors pop. I, I like the dark. I think it's pretty. Okay, well, I've got the link below to this and also to the astrologer that put it, put the link there. Take care. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.